Welcome to the nominations for the 10th Annual Popeye Awards as we celebrate the role of in-store marketing in all areas of shopper engagement and successful retailing. Today the awards are the ultimate symbol of creativity, innovation and best practice. A hallmark of excellence that provides the benchmark for success and the catalyst for continuous improvement. Firstly, a big thank you to all of our gold sponsors. Essentre, Fast Track, Momentum in Store and Solutions Diverse. Thanks too go to all of our silver sponsors. Allrec, Arkan POP, 4Graphics, Callister and Ledridge Lighting. We'd also like to thank the esteemed panel of retail professionals who made up our judging panel this year. Every entry is initially reviewed online against Popeye's robust scoring criteria, with the judges looking for evidence in the submitted case study, photographs and videos of performance against those criteria. After the preliminary round, all entries were taken forward to a full day of final judging, which saw the panel gather in London to share and discuss recommendations before the final nominations are made. The identities of individual entrants remain undisclosed to the judges throughout the duration of the process. Now, let's get down to business. The nominations for the Popeye Awards 2016. And remember, if you've been nominated, it means you've definitely won either gold, silver or bronze in your category. The nominations for the automotive and leisure category are Tom Tom Runner 2 and Spark by HRG UK for TomTom Tom International BV and G3 Permanent Bay by Pivotal Retail Marketing for Ferrecla Products. In the running to win the Sports, Toys and Fashion category are Hasbro EMEA POE Programme by Display Plan for Hasbro. Foot Locker Sneaker Curation by Missouri Creative for Foot Locker Europe. and Tesco Toy Tan by SMP Group BBH for Tesco. Nominated in the Grocery Convenience and GM Permanent Display category are Greenies Rotating Display by Arkan POP for Crown Pet Foods, Kinder Egg FSDU by Creative Instore Solutions Europe for Ferrero UK and Ireland, and Marmite Gravity Feed by In Contrast for Unilever UK. Battling it out in the Grocery Convenience and GM Temporary Display category are the following. Body Form Pink Ticket On Pack by Blue Chip Marketing for SCA Hygiene Products UK. Morrison's Back to Back Penguin by DS Smith Packaging for RMF on behalf of United Biscuits. Comfort Intense Launch Hero by In Contrast for Unilever UK. And Pot Noodle Snack Stack by In Contrast for Unilever. The nominees in the Alcoholic and Soft Drinks category are Costa Express Cups at Till by Display Mode for Costa Express. Stella Artois Wimbledon 2016 by Elvis for AB InBev. And Display Buddy by the Maxim Design Group for BP Oil Retail Operations. Next it's Confectionery Temporary Display and the nominees are Lint Christmas Sleigh by DS Smith Packaging for Lint and Sprungley. Kinder Halloween 360 Wow Display by In Contrast for Ferrero UK. And Walker's Tear and Share Flat Pack by Smurfit Kappa Inspire Pack for Walker's Snacks. Next up it's the Home and Garden category. In contention are Outdoor Paws for Yvale by 4 Graphics for Yvale Garden Centres. Bosch Home Base Garment Care Bay by HRG UK for BSH Home Appliances. 
and Karcha Mixed Range Display by Octopaz for Karcha UK. Now, when it comes to consumer electronics, the following are in the running. Intel 2-in-1 Risers by Arkan POP for Intel Corporation UK. Next Generation Hive Paws by Direction Group for British Gas. And Motorola Wall, Bay and Table by M4 Design Company for Motorola Mobility UK. In the Cosmetics, Beauty, Hair and Fragrance Permanent Display category, the nominees are Freedom Cosmetic Pod in Superdrug by Arkan POP for Medichem. Max Factor MUA Gondola by DM International for Procter & Gamble. And Lynx Trilogy Tester Tray by In Contrast for Unilever UK. Next it's Cosmetics Beauty Hair and Fragrance Temporary Display and in the running this time are Rimmel Only One Lipstick GE by Impact Creative Partnership for Coty. Nivea Men Blip Superdrug by Storm DFX for Byersdorf UK. And Nivea Sun Camper Van by Superior Creative Services for Byersdorf. Pharmacy is the next category. In contention this time are Listerine 21 Day Challenge by Creo for Johnson & Johnson. Q10 Pearl's Mother's Day Arch by In Contrast for Byersdorf UK. And Barocca On The Go by Storm DFX for Bayer. On to retail services and stationery next, and here are the nominees. Thunderbirds Are Go Magazine Rocket by In Contrast for DC Thompson & Co. Game of Thrones Dragon Head by Once Upon a Time for Warner Brothers. And WH Smith Art Surround Unit by SMP Group for WH Smith. Short Run Permanent Display is up next. In the running are Sony Golden Space by Allrec UK for Sony Europe. Oral B Power Fixture Asda by Communisys PLC in conjunction with Impact Retail for Procter and Gamble. And Hasbro Nerf Blaster Zone by Display Plan for Hasbro. Let's take a look at the short run FMCG temporary display category now. Here's who's made it to the shortlist Musgrave CNC Hamper Display by PD for Musgrave Cash and Carry. Ribenary Wow Dump Bin by Smurfit Kappa Display Ireland for Lucasaid Ribena Suntory Ireland. And KP Red Phone Box by Superior Creative Services for KP Snacks. News of the short-run non-FMCG temporary display category next, and here are the nominees. Hair and Beauty Experiential Unit by Impact Creative Partnership for Unilever. The Entertainer 2015 Christmas Window by Simpson Group for The Entertainer. And OVO Midmall Retail Concept by The One-Off for OVO Energy. We turn our attention to Flagship and Store next. In the running, Mummers and Puppers by DL and Pow for Mummers and Puppers. Wyvale Garden Centre Cardiff by Four Graphics for Wyvale Garden Centres. And Joseph Plastic Restraint by Harlequin Design for Harlequin Design. We have Shop in Shop as our next category. The nominees are Sky the Engage by Allrec UK for Sky. Volvo Pop-Up Stores by TRO for Volvo Car UK.
and EE Interactive Brand Experience by Vivid Brand for EE. Campaign is the next category, just two battling it out here. They are Lego Dimensions Launch Campaign by Once Upon a Time for Warner Brothers and Sky Q Experiential Campaign by 1.0 for Sky. The nominees in the installation category are as follows. Camelot National Lottery Rollout by Momentum in Store for Camelot. Sky Q Experiential Campaign by 1.0 for Sky. And EE Interactive Brand Experience by Vivid Brand for EE. Making the final three for innovation are Sky Q Experiential Campaign 1.0 for Sky. Benefit Cosmetics Twitter Vending Machine by SMP Group Breed and Create London for Benefit Cosmetics. And EE Interactive Brand Experience by Vivid Brand for EE. And in sustainability, there are three contenders Freedom Cosmetic Pod in Superdrug by Arkan POP for Medichem. Walker's Slimline Unit by Display Plan for PepsiCo International UK and Ireland. And Health and Beauty Asda Event Tray by Storm DFX for Unilever UK. And that completes the nominations for the 10th annual Popeye Awards. Make sure you book your place for the awards ceremony and dinner at the Lancaster London Hotel on Tuesday the 4th of October 2016. Until then, you can visit www.popeye.co.uk forward slash awards to view all this year's nominees and for detailed case studies of every entry into the 2016 Popeye Awards.